Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm gonna try this Pierre meatloaf sandwich. Um, it's uh, home favorites over half a pound. It's pretty good. It says it's with ketchup. We bought these at Walmart, it was $2.98, and Robert had recommended that I try these, and we've never had them in our area until uh, we went to the store this time, and it's like, oh wow, they actually have that sandwich, so we're trying it out. So thanks Robert for, for letting me know it was out there. This is what it looks like. If I get under the light. Looks like a slab of meatloaf. So calorie-wise, if you eat uh, one sandwich, it's 660 calories. So I probably won't eat the whole sandwich, but I might. I don't know. I'll save probably half of it for later. Uh, but there's the other stuff for you. And to heat this up, it's microwave. So you open the wrapper slightly to vent. Uh, microwave for 140 to 2. I will probably do 150. Uh, let it sit for 30 seconds, then remove the wrapper and enjoy it. So I'm going to get this in the microwave, and uh, I'll be back. All right, here's the sandwich. Um, I tell you, I had to get scissors to cut this wrapper because it's plastic lined and it did not want to rip open. So anyway, that, that is hard to open. So here's what it looks like. It looks like it's two meatloaf patties with ketchup. Quite a bit of ketchup on them, actually. So I'm gonna let this cool off for a little bit. I mean, you're supposed to let it sit for 30 seconds anyway. So I'm gonna let it cool off a bit and I'll be back. Okay, it's had a little time to cool off. It's a pretty good sized sandwich. I mean, it's uh, takes up my whole hand. It's like a foot long sub almost. Um, I'll take a bite right there. I want to recommend that you flip the sandwich upside down um, as you're letting it cool off because the bottom will be very hot and, and get very um, like soggy feeling. You don't want it to get super soggy and it wouldn't be very good. I have to say, it's a pretty good sandwich. It's more like a, um, it's got this like charbroiled kind of flavor to it. So it's more like a charbroiled patty, a hamburger patty, than meatloaf necessarily. Um, but I do have to say, it's really good. I'm not, I don't think I can rip it in half. Um, it could probably use a little bit more um, onion in it to be, uh, to be like what I would consider meatloaf. But um, the ketchup sauce is good. It's not super ketchupy. It's not really tomatoey. Um, you don't get that sweetness of the, t of the ketchup too much, but it is there. It's just not really strong. Um, if I were to eat this um, again, or maybe even finish this one off, I'll probably put a little bit more ketchup on it because I like ketchup. But um, but it's fine the way it is. Um, this is a good sandwich. If you can get this at Walmart, definitely try it out. I think it's um, I think it'd be well worth your tr your uh, troubles. Um, I'm gonna go to four. It is a really good sandwich. It's it's big too. I mean, you get a ton. Uh, to eat and the flavors are pretty good. It's not like I said, it's not necessarily what I would consider meatloaf But it is definitely a good charbroiled um, patty um, With a good charred flavor So I like it. So, um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching